My name is Winston Kim. I'm a consultant orthopedic surgeon. I'm a specialist in hip and knee surgery with a particular interest in robot-assisted hip, knee, and partial knee replacements. Robot-assisted joint replacement combines CT imaging with 3D technology to enable the surgeon to construct a surgical plan which is tailored to individual patients. So what this means is patient-specific implant positioning, which is tailored to individual patients, depending on the size, the shape, the alignment of the joint, which is different for all of us. Even before surgery, I'm able to plan and visualize the implant position, which is customized to the individual patient. During surgery, sensors are placed around the joint, which allows the software and the robot to detect that joint in three dimensions. The robot arm enters the surgical field and removes bone precisely and accurately to fractions of millimetres, preserving bone and soft tissue around the joint. What this means for patients is quicker recovery, less pain, reduced requirements for pain relief, shorter hospital stay, and it should also translate into joints that are more normal or natural feeling and it should also translate into joints that are longer lasting. In traditional joint replacement surgery, the clinical outcome is dependent on the training and experience of the surgeon. In robot-assisted joint replacement, it is the combination of the skill and experience of the surgeon together with enabling technology that maximizes the potential for a predictable and consistent technical outcome for each and every patient and each and every time. The robot is an assistant to the surgeon. The surgeon is always present at the time of the operation together with a robot product specialist. This technology allows for better planning or enhanced planning for the individual patient based on a customized plan and the ability to consistently and reproducibly execute that plan, resulting in a better technical outcome for patients. This would result in a higher likelihood of reduced complications in a joint that feels natural or is normal feeling, and should also result in a higher likelihood of the joint lasting longer. In the hip joint, so much more information is available to the surgeon now than was previously available. So what this means is that the surgeon is able to very accurately and precisely assess the range of movement during surgery, minimizing the risk that the hip would catch and dislocate, maximize the potential for reconstructing a joint that meets the modern patient's requirement for a natural feeling or normal feeling joint. This technology is transformative for surgeons because it's about being able to better plan for surgery and to have a plan that is customized to that individual patient and to have the ability to predictably and consistently execute that plan for patients.